farmer had an ancient donkey and this donkey fell into a well in the yard around the farmhouse and the farmer decided well they're so busy at that moment it's not worth saving either because this well was dried up and the donkey was very old. So he called the workers and he told them bring soil and with wheelbarrows full of soil they started filling the well. Initially the donkey brayed terribly and he was going on and going and screaming then it fell silent and after a while the farmer thought he must just look if this donkey is now gone and he looked down the well and he was gobsmacked. What he saw was this little donkey cheekily standing on top of the pile of sand. What happened, he watched him in awe. What happened, every time they, they threw in the sand and they chucked in another spade full of sand, the donkey would just shake it off and trample on it and climb on top of it. And eventually, he said to them, continue, eventually when the well was filled, he just jumped over the little wall and off he went on his merry way. And the message in this to me is just fantastic. Because he didn't let up. He just went over and over and over. And in it, well, in the end, it worked out so well. And Jesus prepared his disciples for the same type of things. There will be, there will be attacks. You will land in a hole. It will feel like you have nowhere to go. And when people write you off, this is what he told the disciples. Luke 9, 4 says, And whatever house you enter, stay there, and from there depart. But whenever they do not receive you, when you leave that town, shake off the dust from your feet as a testimony against them. While the prophet said in Isaiah 52, 2, Shake yourself from the dust and arise, O Jerusalem. Lose the bonds from your neck and be free. So, do not be shaken when it seems absolutely hopeless, when there's a crisis that hits, when you are discouraged and it seems there's no way out. It might be dark and you might feel these little stones just pelting down on you. But you know what? Do what the donkey did. Just when you feel written off, shake it off, step on it, trample it and climb up. Just go up higher. And I read from Malachi 4 verse 3. When I, God, come to bring justice, you will trample those who are evil as though they were dust under your feet. And I, the Lord all-powerful, have spoken. Then in Isaiah 29, he says, From the deep of the earth, you will call out for help with only a faint whisper. Not like the donkey. You, you can't even scream out loud then your cruel enemies will suddenly be swept away like dust in a windstorm and this is what the Lord has for you when you are in this well when you feel there's no way circumstances as well as just trying to bury you do what the donkey did shake it off step on it trample it climb out Let's pray. Father, thank you that you have a plan for us always. You always have an incredible way of just showing us in the smallest things and in the biggest things how to shake it off, step on it and just get out of it. And I thank you that you help us in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.